Hello, this is my submission for the Android Experiment Contest. Uh, what I kind of built here is a 3D mouse for Blender 3D, uh, which is an open source 3D modeling and animation package. Uh, 3D mouses are kind of these cool tools, but are very expensive. So I was going to build something with Arduino, but since the con the contest was announced, I decided, you know what, let me see if I can make my Android devices into virtual uh, 3D mice that can control uh, Blender. Uh, Android itself cannot really do Bluetooth, uh, can, can't do serial connections to a PC. So I had to get a couple of boards and uh, connect them together. Um, a Bluetooth to serial and a USB to serial board. They're uh, wired together, connected to the PC. You can follow the nice blue lights. And then we got the Android device. The, here's the app I put together. So you get a list of devices that are paired. So I can just click on that and voila. Uh, now it's connected to my PC. Uh, at the same time, I got to run the script on Blender. It's not a plugin yet, but uh, right now it runs as a script. Uh, so we have a list of commands that uh, we can run that are programmed. And over here we have the gesture area. So let's uh, see how well we can control Blender with uh, Android. So as you can see, we can pan. Uh, we can zoom in, zoom out with three finger gesture. And using a two finger gesture, I'm able to rotate the world. Uh, I can do roll two. If I'm in the two finger gesture and let go of one, I should be able to do a roll as well. So all right, let's uh, start making stuff. So since the 3D cursor is out there, let me actually send the command to center cursor. There's a cursor. And uh, let's add ourselves a cube. Magically, there's a cube. All right, hey, look at that. There, there's our nice, beautiful cube. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Love it. We all love our 3D cubes. Now, uh, let's go to edit mode. It's hard to see. All right, now we're in edit mode. Now I can tap on uh, deselect all. Beautiful. And let me just grab the top. All right. Uh, let's uh, extrude. Click on the extrude command. Voila. Beautiful. And I can click over here. Extrude that one too. Boom. Beautiful. Uh, you know what? I want to rotate that thing. Let's rotate it on the, since I have rotate X, there we go. I can rotate like crazy. You know what? I want to be able to see that rotation a little better. So let me rotate the model so I can have a nice look while I'm rotating. So I can still send commands while using my mouse to control the current operation in Blender. So, whoa. All right, let's go this way. There we go. So I want to do that. That looks good to me. Uh, so you can zoom out, see what the whole, how the whole world looks like. Very nice, very nice. Um, so let's get out of edit mode. Now we are in um, object mode. Let me zoom in. So you can see there's no vertices or edge selections. So let me do the roll gesture. There you go. Make it nice and centered. And let's spin around. All right. Now with the object selected, how about we do a grab at the z-axis? Now I can control the, the z-axis. Uh, let me pan down a little bit. There you go. So I can see. Use two finger gestures to change the rotation a little bit. Still trying to get this thing perfectly calibrated. Um, you know, spend two weeks for learning Python and how to make this work in Blender. Not 100% perfect, but it's pretty good. Uh, now let's scale this on the X and Y plane. 
or axis I should say. Click on that and voila, now I can only scale at that stage. Undo that, how about we just want to scale it on the Z axis, boom. Now I can control the Z axis. And again, while the operation is going on, I can still send commands and control the view. Um, so there you go. There's uh, my prototype of virtual 3D mouse for Blender. And that's my submission. And I hope uh, you guys enjoyed what, what I see. Goodbye.